Hi, I'm Debbie. Today I'm going to talk about teaching your baby farm animal sounds. Most babies are fascinated by animals and the noises they make. Not only is it fun for children to learn animal sounds, it teaches them an important lesson. Animals use noises to communicate. Learning animal noises is also beneficial for speech development. Simple noises we assign to farm animals such as ba and moo are easy for babies to learn and a great way to start working on speech. Once children can make these sounds, they can build on that to um, learn other words and even sentences. The best way for, way for babies to learn animal sounds is through real world interactions. This is why um, the sounds of family pets may be learned before other animals, but not everyone lives on a farm or can even visit one. Therefore, a good way to learn farm animal sounds is through songs and toys. You can use toys such as these. Um, this set came with a barn that played the sounds for you, but it is even better for children to hear someone make the sounds in person so that they can see how to make the sound with their mouths. Singing Old MacDonald is a wonderful way to teach farm animal noises. You already know the song and it involves lots of repetition, which is the key to learning. Another great song that is, um, will work for teaching farm animal noises is called When Cows Get Up in the Morning, and you can include any animal you would like. We'll start with cows since that's the, um, in the title. When cows get up in the morning, they always say hello. When cows get up in the morning, they always say hello. And what do they say? Moo! And that is what they say. When pigs get up in the morning, they always say hello. When pigs get up in the morning, they always say hello. And what do they say? Oink, oink. And that is what they say. When sheep get up in the morning, they always say hello. When sheep get up in the morning, they always say hello. And what do they say? Ba. And that is what they say. If singing gets your baby dancing or moving the farm animals, that's even better because um, movement stimulates the brain. And when babies are introduced to language in the context of movement, they are more likely to understand and retain it. So the next time your baby sees a farm animal or is playing with farm toys, um, sing about the animal sounds to enhance the learning experience. Until next time, happy cock-a-doodle-doing!